so in today's video, I'm going to be showing you and teaching you how to make a lava spinner in Roblox Studio. Knowledge. So let's get right to it. So when you open up Roblox Studio, you want to make a base plate for your game. And once you're in your game, then you want to head up to the top menu over here and click the part button to make a part. And this is going to be the base of our spinner, so I'm going to make it a square. And then you can do Control c Control v and this part will be our spinner. So you want to hold down control and scale it out as long as you want. And uh, the spinner can be any color you want. So I'm going to make it a nice red color. And now that we completed the model, we can name this to spinner and start scripting it. So we have to make a script and I'm going to rename it to spin script. And now you follow along with my coding. So first we have to make a variable for the speed of the spinner. So I'm going to make that 5. So this is how fast the uh, spinner is going to go. Then we have to make a loop to keep the spinner going. So we do while task.wait 0.01 do. Now we have to get the spinner object, so script.parent. So script.parent and then this, an orientation to get the rotation of the spinner is equal to script.parent.orientation uh, plus vector 3 dot new zero speed zero so it's adding this much rotation every single loop in the script so that's what keeps the spinner spinning so we completed the spinning script and we should we have to select the spinner again then add another script and this script is going to be named the kill script and it's what's going to kill the player when they hit the lava spinner. So first we want to get the spinner object, object again, so script.parent, then dot touch. So when it gets touched, we make a function, and whatever hit the object is this variable here, which is hit. Then we have to make sure it's a player that hit the spinner, so if hit.parent find first child humanoid. So this checks if a player hit the spinner, and if a player did hit the spinner, then we do hit dot dot parent dot humanoid so the humanoid is what controls the player dot health which is the health of the player then we make a zero so the player dies when they hit the spinner so now that we finish the spinner you have to select all the parts of it and go to the top part and make sure they're anchored so they don't fly away just like uh, two seconds ago all right now that we're for sure ready we have to hit play back at the top of the screen so now we're in the game and we can see that the spinner is spinning properly and you could jump over it and when it hits you you die instantly so that's how you make a lava spinner in roblox studio and if you guys enjoyed make sure to like and subscribe check out my profile and group in the description and i'll see you guys in the next video see ya